This is uh, the DOT's concrete brake lab. Uh, we test concrete cylinders for compressive strength here. So we get these four by eight inch cylinders from the field. They're 28 day or 56 day brakes. We put them in the curing room for that time. It's in there for 95% humidity. Uh, we take them from the curing room and from there we put them in the brake machine for compressive strength. It breaks the cylinder and tells us how strong the concrete is. It's just for design strength so we know that the project won't fail, the bridge deck won't fail, the curb won't just fall apart. Here's an example of what we're looking for. This is a cone break and here you can see the aggregate has broken with the material so that means it's acting as one, one piece of material and not separate pieces. What you don't want to see is aggregate not cracked or broken and just fully intact with dried up concrete around it, just not no adherence or anything like that. All concrete used on NJDOT projects is tested in this lab for required design strength. So there are multiple other labs testing this material from the coarse aggregate lab that's testing the aggregate and the cement lab that is testing the cement that is in the concrete. There are a lot of people working at the DOT to make sure all the projects and materials are up to standards. 